Hi guys, it's Home Pack with another video. So today, I know I look a little dusty right now, but that's because today I'm going to be doing my skincare routine, my daytime and nighttime skincare routine. So I didn't obviously wash my face yet because I'm gonna show you guys what I do. So yeah, let's just get started. Um, oh shoot, wait, let me put my hair up because I'm not trying to get it wet. Okay, I put my hair up. I look like an egg, but it's fine. Um, and I'm like squat. I'm like squatting because I'm like way too tall for my setup. Um, but yeah, so my skincare routine is fairly simple. I don't have like some 14 step routine because if I did, then I would probably be very turned off by it. So yeah, this is just mine is like my daytime routine is like five steps, four or five steps. Um, but yeah, it's fairly simple, easy to follow. So let's just get started. So my face wash that I use is this set of well set of fell set of fill gentle skin cleanser i yeah i use the gentle one i don't really like the like it's like normal the other one's like normal to dry because my skin isn't dry so um yeah so i use this um and then i'll like i'll use my hands to like rub it in and i like rub it in for like 60 seconds all right so it's been a minute so now i'm just gonna wash it off my face okay so after i'm done washing my face uh, the next step I do is I use this alcohol, this Neutrogena alcohol-free toner. Um, I take like a cotton ball. So I just put it on, I rub it all around my face and I let it sit for like a couple minutes um, just so it can like, I guess, absorb. I don't even know what this does. I don't know if it works, but I just do it anyway. And I usually do my neck, but I have a turtleneck on right now and I don't want to do all that. So we're just going to do the face right now. Okay, I feel like I can go on to the next step because the toner has been absorbed into my skin. Next step in my daytime routine, I use the Cetaphil Moisturizing Lotion for your face. I mean, you can put it on your body too, but I use it for my face. And yeah, I, I mean, I don't, I, I squeeze way too much. I, I don't even put a lot on, like, I just, you know, like, I, I just put it on my face, I rub it in, gotta get it everywhere. Oh, that's attractive, okay. Okay, so that's all into my skin. So in the beginning of the year, that would have been like it. I would have been like, okay, that's it for the day. But I just added this next step in this year because I just kind of learned like the importance of SPF. Um, shout out to my sister for that because she really like put me onto this. This is the last step in the my daytime routine, but I use um, this SPF. It's called uh, Black Girl Sunscreen. It's the SPF 31 and it's it's so good especially for for black people because I was using this other like SPF in the beginning of the year like very briefly but I, I hated it because it like left like a white cast I think it was like the CeraVe one um it's just not <laughs> it is not compatible with like darker skin so then I was like I need to change it so I heard about like the black girl sunscreen and I bought it and I wanted to try it and I love it because it like really I honestly feel like it like improved my skin because I feel like it gives you like a dewy look because it's kind of like I guess it's it's oily that's why I don't try to put like too much on I'll dab it like so I'll do that I'll put it in like every area on my face I got my mouth here forehead and then don't forget your eyelids too i feel like a lot of people like neglect their eyelids but you should always remember to put it there because those age too trust me when you get older that's gonna not look the same so yeah i just i don't know it, it's you should put it on every day a lot of people are like why are you putting on spf in the winter you're supposed to put it on every day even if you're not even leaving the house even if it's raining out and there's no sunlight like just put it on every day, there's no harm in it. And I usually put it on my neck too, but I have a turtleneck on, so there's no point. Um, but don't forget your neck as well, because that's that's really important too. So that is the end of the daytime skincare routine. My nighttime one is like slightly different, but it's not too much. So see you guys at night when I do my nighttime skincare routine. 
okay guys so it is now like 12 30 so i'm about to go to bed in a little bit but now i'm about to show you my nighttime skincare routine um yeah so i'm gonna put my hair up first because i'm not trying to get my hair wet that's out like in my daytime routine i use the cetaphil gentle skin cleanser so oh wait i'm gonna wet my face first because you know we can't wash our face with a dry face so like in my daytime one i'm gonna like wash my face for 60 seconds okay 60 seconds is up i'm about to wash it off my face and then we're gonna go to the next step like in my daytime one i use the um alcohol free neutrogena toner yeah put that all on my face put it on your face let it sit for a few minutes and then i'm gonna show you all the last step so the last step in this routine is i put some cocoa butter on my face um every night yeah i just i don't know i feel like it just really helps my skin literally like a few years ago maybe like three or four years ago my skin was in literal shambles um i would insert a photo but i don't know if i want that on the internet so um yeah so my skin was really bad like i had like dark spots all over my face just because like honestly like i really just had a lack of skincare routine i didn't even have a set routine i was just kind of like i don't even fucking know i was just kind of raw dogging it every day so yeah once like my skin started going to shit i was like yeah i need something i need a skincare routine because this isn't cute so i started using this the cocoa butter um i put it on every night because it like makes your face really like greasy so you wouldn't want to be putting that on during the daytime and walking around with a greasy ass face so yeah i put it on every night and it literally like i'm telling you it literally faded my dark spots in like maybe like three or four months i don't know like i mean over like my skin has gotten better over the years but like when my skin was like really bad like it just helped really quickly like i feel like it was starting to fade like in a few months and i don't know if this is like something a lot of people put on their face every night i don't know but it's helped me tremendously and i just love the way it makes my skin feel even when you wake up like it's still like on your face and it just makes your skin feel so like soft and like i feel like um this is like partly the reason why i feel like my skin is really like just healthy now and really um just like moisturize and it's not dry because i put this on every day every night and it just really helps so yeah i put the cocoa butter like all over my face i'm like rub it in don't hurt the eyelids and be like, generous with it like don't want to be stingy like rub the shit in for real for real all over your face and you see how it like makes your skin like really like shiny and greasy but it's like so worth it plus you're about to go to bed so it doesn't even really matter but yeah guys so that's it those that's my skincare routine for the daytime and the nighttime it's so like simple like i'm telling you really do not need to do these i mean i don't know everyone's skin is different i have skin i don't my skin is just like not i guess complicated where i have to do like all this extra shit you really don't need a huge long skincare routine like you can really just find some really good products that work for you um this is stuff that works for me so you know if you want to try it feel free it works for me hopefully it works for y'all my favorite thing that i do is use the cocoa butter and i also love using my spf because i feel like those are like the main products that just have really helped my skin and made it just like soft and like for like a more of like a dewy look that i'm trying to go for but yeah so um wash your face moisturize every day just do it you don't want to like wake up when you're like 40 and you look like you're 60. we're trying to preserve our skin now when we're young and we're setting ourselves up for when we're older and we get the wrinkles but it won't be as bad because we're moisturizing and we're taking care of our skin now when we're young so there you go so yeah guys that's going to be the end of this video please like comment down below subscribe i'm really trying to hit 100 subscribers i'm at like 70 i think i don't know something like that i feel like i'm always saying this but i'm really 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 trying to be more consistent with my channel i'm just trying to like figure out where i want to like do with it i'm trying to think of ideas like it's hard for me 
bear with me. Trying to at least do like maybe two videos a month. Maybe we have, we're figuring it out. But yeah, so um, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.